Hey guys, my name is Eddie. I'm a maths teacher in Australia, and I'm here to give you a quick maths lesson on probability. What is probability? Probability is the chance of something happening. There are two different types of probability, experimental and theoretical. Today we're going to talk about experimental probability, which is the probability obtained from conducting an experiment. If I was going to take a shot right now, what would be the chance of this shot going in? Now let's do an experiment to find out. game I just played with my brother, I got three shots in out of nine, which explains why I'm a math teacher and not a basketball player. Now from those numbers, is there a way for us to calculate the probability of success every time I shoot the ball in a game? This probability will determine whether my teammates pass the ball to me in a real game. So let's have a look at the actual math involved in calculating experimental probability. The textbook equation for experimental probability is the probability of an event happening P bracket E is equal to the number of times event E occurs divided by total number of trials. Okay, so if you remember from our experiment, uh, the number of times event E occurs, our event was shooting the ball into the hoop. And the number of times it has occurred, if you remember, I got a total of three shots into the hoop. So, that's three. The total number of trials, and that simply means uh, how many shots have I taken. And I've actually taken nine shots in total in that game against my brother. So, therefore, probability of E occurring is 3 divided by 9 which is equal to 1 out of 3 if you simplify the fraction and if you put in 1 divided by 3 in the calculator you will get 0 0.3 recurring so that's 0 0.333 or you can write it as 0 0.3 recurring or you can write it as 33.3% and uh, we've actually rounded that to one decimal place. So you can see that there are three different ways of expressing probability. You can either write it as a fraction which is 1 over 3 so that's one way of expressing probability 
or you can write it as a decimal which is 0 0.3 recurring or you can write it as a percentage which is 33.3% uh, now normally it would be written as a decimal but depending on what your teacher tells you uh, just listen to what they say so where is this uh, probability used in real life well if you have a look at the website uh, www.mba.com which is uh, the professional basketball league in America uh, you will see that uh, for every team there is a field goal percentage which I'm gonna circle here and that is pretty much the same thing as what I've just calculated field goal percentage uh, what I just did before was the probability of success whenever I shoot the ball they pretty much mean the same thing so you can see that Denver when they're playing at their home court only has 0 0.476 as their field goal percentage and that's actually the top of the NBA so my shooting percentage of 0 0.33 in comparison to this which is the professional basketball league I don't think my shooting percentage is too bad at all okay guys well this concludes my uh, math lesson thank you for watching uh, and I'll see you next time